Public Health Minister Anutin Shanwiragun announced yesterday that Bangkok's Bang Su Grand Station will no longer offer walk-in vaccinations from August 1st or this coming Sunday. This means that people who want to be inoculated will have to register in advance. The vaccination services will be provided to people over 18 years of age and those afflicted with any of the seven underlying diseases. Currently, people can just walk in to get vaccinated. So far, many people from Bangkok's neighboring provinces, such as Supanburi and Rashaburi, have flocked to the railway station to receive the free service, resulting in overcrowding and concerns over the possible spread of COVID-19. Anutin said that officials from the Transport Ministry, which owns the railway station, have stepped in to enforce social distancing and to ensure members of the public wear face masks all the time and as their way to be inoculated. Although walk-in services will still be available until the end of the month for non-registrants. He said priority will be given to people over 60, those who weigh more than 100 kilograms and pregnant women. Despite crowds of people queuing for vaccination during the peak hours from 8 a.m. to 10 a.m., the minister said that not a single medic working at the station has been found to be infected and the vaccination process has been going smoothly. He advised people to show up in the afternoon, which will help ease the congestion as opposed to the morning, and to make advance appointments by using Vaccine Bangsu app, which will enable them to get to the vaccination points without going through additional paperwork. Bangsu Grand Station is currently Thailand's largest vaccination center and has been operated by the Medical Services Department since May 24th. As of July 25th, almost um, 1 million doses of vaccine have been administered by more than 422 medics, and an average of 20,000 people are inoculated each day. Meanwhile, the CCSA's assistant spokeswoman, Dr. Apisamai Zirangsan, said the Ministry of Public Health feels the mass vaccination to achieve the target of inoculating 50% of the country's population is proceeding quite slowly in the provinces and has instructed all provinces to accelerate the process. So we can see that there are many cues being formed right now, uh, both for the COVID-19 testing for the vaccination and also for treatment. So many things are going on at the same time right now.